Hi, I'm Abby Ingham and this is Pal TV. We're in the main shopping street centre in Durham asking people about their daily lives. There's the best view in Durham. I say up the hill, there's a little observatory place where you can kind of get a view of the whole of Durham. It's really nice, kind of round the top hill for the St. Aidan. Where is the best place to eat in Durham? <laughs> Big talk. Um, I haven't gone there, but I've heard that it's actually amazing. Yeah. Like, actually amazing. I haven't gone there. White chairs. Uh, yeah, white chairs. Yeah. You know white chairs. Really nice. Oh, there's so many. There are lots of really nice independent restaurants. The classics are Spags. There's Fat Hippo, which is amazing burgers. Um, they're not that big for. There's Bistro Italiano, which it's just really nice, authentic Italian food. And it's really reasonably priced as well. So I'd say it's okay. Where's the best coffee in Durham? It's the time for me between Cafe Jarrell and Chapel's. I love Chapel's coffee. So I like white coffee. Oh, white coffee. Yeah. Yeah. What is your customer like in Durham? Well, we're coming from London, so it's just like it's a cheap ass. <laughs> I think. Drinking culture here is oh quite extreme, <laughs> so I think that ramps up the price. Yeah. I'm self-catered in itself, so I'm still able to eat to a budget of about seventy pounds a week with going out, with buying food, um, and stuff. So, so, so here is really really expensive, so not great. And halls are also not great, but you can manage. Yeah. one ball. That's one thing I'd say. Before you graduate you have to experience a dark My parents go up there. Yeah. <laughs> or uh, go to the house. Yeah. That's yeah. something I'll just do. That's something that's going to be done. Do you think there was a step up from school to university? I'd say definitely, especially with see my year being the year of um, the big COVID changes so we had had about six months without doing any work at all so yeah that was quite a shock we just had a game well we, we both do law so we've never done the subject before in secondary school high school so step up yeah I guess so uh, the workload's a lot more there's a lot more reading the, focus is different, the teaching style is different as well. It's a lot more independent work as well, um, but I reckon as long as you stay relatively organised, it's, it's definitely manageable. Do you have to work as hard as you thought you would? Honestly, no. I, I thought, because when we were first told that we'd have to do what, 40 hours of reading a week or something, I was, I expected a lot more work. Not really, to be honest. Online things were quite relaxed, so no. Where do you think the best place to work is? Oh, I would say the Billy B has the best atmosphere, but I do prefer the TLC, even though you can't really get a place there. Library? Uh, just hop into a empty study room and get your work done. It's quite productive. Do you think 9am's are worth it? No. No, not for me, just biology has to go up cardiac Depends on the module, and depends on the lecture, I'd say. And whether the group of friends you go with to the lecture decide to wake up and go with you. And if it's on your the night you haven't gone out on every other day? Yeah, basically. I haven't missed a 9am yet, okay. so he's a good boy. Wow. I, I can't say the same. Yeah. <laughs>